One of Australia's deadliest spiders landed up in my house. The classic red dorsal stripe runs across its abdomen, aposematic coloration serving as a warning to predators. Don't touch me. The infamous redback spider. Just how deadly are they? Latrodectus hasselti is a comb-footed spider like the one I used to own prior. They belong to the family Therididae. These spiders make irregular webs which traps their prey. Redback spiders are native to South and or Western Australia and now have spread across the country. Are they related to black widow spiders? No, they are black widows. The genus Lactrodectus contains 34 species and they are all collectively known as widow spiders, black or brown. These spiders are infamous for their extremely venomous bites. Don't get me wrong, all spiders, with the exception of those of family Euloboridae, are venomous, but most of them do not have potent venom. Redbacks do. Their venom is neurotoxic, which means that it affects neurotransmitters in the body until you lose control of every part of yourself. Listed here are the symptoms of the bite. And yes, these can have potentially fatal effects. Let's pull up the statistics. Antivenom for redback bites has been produced in the early 1950s and because of this there has been only one reported death from a bite since then. Redbacks are not very defensive spiders. Their fangs are small and the chance of them biting is extremely low. To demonstrate, I touched the spider with my tweezers and it did not strike. It moved away instead. To further demonstrate this, I am actually going to hold this girl. Was I nervous? No, I coaxed her onto my hand and sure enough, she ran up my arm. These spiders do not seek to bite you. In situations where the spider cannot run away, it might resort to biting. So what should you do if you come across a redback spider? They make their tangled webs underneath objects such as tables and chairs and you can easily identify females. You should ideally just leave them alone and make sure that no one comes in contact with them accidentally. If you know how to catch spiders, you can cup it and take it far away from your house or keep the spider. I hope this video provided value to you. If so, be sure to share it with others so they are also aware of what to do. If you've been watching my videos for a while, subscribe as you won't regret it. This is ABSE signing out. Take care and goodbye.